Okay, we're in the LaCroix booth. Patrick, why don't you tell me what, uh, what you've got here? Yeah, so we're showing our new Qualify Automated Test Package mm -hmm. for um, transmitter compliance testing for the new 56G PAM4 base standards. So that's a bunch okay. of uh, OIF and IEEE mm -hmm. standards that mm -hmm. use 28 gigabaud PAM4 yep. signaling yep. to achieve 56 gigabit per second throughput mm -hmm. uh, on a single lane. Uh, and then they're uh, aggregated together into multiple lanes to achieve, sure. you know, 50, 100, 200 G, 400 G. 400 G, whatever it is, yeah. Um, yep. So what we have is we have a Certes chip mm -hmm. here, mm -hmm. transmitting 28 gig PAM4 yep. into our 65 gig oscilloscope, 65 okay. gigahertz oscilloscope. Yep. And um, on here we've acquired the waveform, mm -hmm. uh, and we've done a bunch of compliance tests. Let me just take a look over here. Okay. So this is a test report from this device. Mm -hmm. uh, where we've done a whole bunch of, in this case, these are the uh, OIF CEI 56G VSR, so very short reach. Very short reach, yeah. Uh, tests. Uh, you can see a bunch of the tests there. Mm -hmm. uh, for each test, we have the measured value and the criteria it was tested against, whether okay. it was a pass or fail. Mm -hmm. And then we have details uh, of all the tests and screenshots. Okay. Mm -hmm. um, so, for example, here, uh, what we've kind of left the scope running is the uh, eye mask test, yep. where we uh, we have a mask, and this is defined by the standard. A okay. Quarter you, one quarter unit interval horizontal mask like one that. One quarter UI. Okay. Uh, mm -hmm. And it's positioned dynamically depending on the width of the ten to the minus three contour, the one yep. to the minus three contour. Now, is, the, the is this the contour that that it's centering on, or is it's, it is it from the cross? It's centering the on this red oh. contour, which is okay. the one to the minus three contour of the middle eye. Okay. All right? I see. Okay. Um, and. Then the green contour is the 1E minus 6 contours. Those mm -hmm. are the ones that actually have to be wider than the mask. Okay, okay. I see. So yep. the, the red contour determines the position, and then mm -hmm. the green contour is the pass fail. Okay. But this width, not only do these two points have to be outside the mask, mm -hmm. right? But if you think about it, if the mask, if, if the eye is too narrow, mm -hmm. it's going to fail. Sure. But also, if it's offset, it'll also, also fail. Also so this fail. is yep. like a combination skew and eye width test. Okay. Um, so this is this is the minimum. Minimum, this is the minimum to pass. Minimum to make horizontal eye width at to, 10 to the minus 6. At 10 minus, okay. And 1 e minus 6. Okay. But also, even if this if this eye is wide enough, if it's offset sufficiently, mm -hmm. uh, it's also going to fail because the receiver generally is going to sample all three levels at the same time. I see. Okay. 